So this is a video to show you how you can make a simple website or so develop a simple website. Okay, so with this one now, what we're going to do is we're going to make a very, very, very simple website. It will be containing two headings, uh, a picture, and uh, some text, or let's just say a paragraph. So we'll be, I'll be using HTML, so it subscribe so that you not miss the future videos that will be coming because it's going to be a, a course. So this is the first video, and then more videos will come teaching you how to make websites. And then after that course, you'll be able now to make uh, to make uh, websites for people so that you can actually get paid out of it. Okay, so the first thing that you do is you have to have Notepad++ installed on your computer or any text editor. So I've got, there is a video on our, on this channel that will, will, will show you how to download and install uh, Notepad++. So with this one, with this video now, I won't go much on it. So let's go straight into it. So the first thing that you do is you can create a folder. I'll start by creating a folder. Okay, and then from there now I'll just go into the folder and I'll create a file. You right click and then you go to new and then you go to text documents. And then from there, let's just name that document um, first or any name that you, you want to name it. And then I'll click on this. So can you see that here it says uh, file.txt. If you if your computer doesn't show this one now the extension you can just go to view and then you click here where they say file name extensions okay but mine is already ticked so there's no need for me to, to mark because it's already marked okay so now we want to change the extension so you let's say rename so you just remove the text and then now you you put html because it's going to be an html file because you'll be using HTML to do the programming. And then here to give you a, a window like this, and then you just say yes. And then from there you can refresh. So can you see now that it will become your, your your window? Okay, so let's just open this. So you can click there, it will go straight to your web browser. So we haven't done any 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 coding, so there's nothing here. So it's just a blank page. Okay, and then you go back. Let me just minimize this. Now you go back to your file and then you, you right click. And then you go to edit with notepad sometimes if you have got other um, text editor it will give you an option to say edit with that specific editor but i use a notepad plus plus so i'll click on notepad plus plus so the good thing about um, text ed editors now is you can actually have both windows at the same time i'll be having my browser here and i will type things here and then i'll check my progress okay so the first thing that you do is with html now you'll be using tags opening tag and a closing tag. So the first thing that you do is you put them HTML tag. So the text will look like this. And then inside it will be HTML. So can you see that it's already giving me um, predictions here. So I can just click here. I can, I will just say uh, HTML like this for the opening tag and then for the closing tag. And then inside there I'll say HTML. So I'll be a bit slower on this one. For you to, to 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 follow okay so this is our borders so this is our opening and our closing of uh, the whole program of the whole scripts okay so from there now i'll put my body so the next text now will be the body tag okay so i'll put my two closing texts so for the body is b o d y and then the closing tag it will be backslash body Body like that. Okay, and then now I press enter like that. Okay, so we are um, we are done now with our initial uh, text, and then now we go to the first thing that we want to put now onto our website. So I will put the heading, the first heading. So the text, everything that should be putting in, you'll be using text. So this will be for my heading. So for heading one, it will be h1, and then the closing tag will be h1 uh, and then with a backslash so all the all the closing text will be having a, a, a hash a, um, a, a backslash okay so in between here that's where you put your heading so i'll call my heading my first website so i'll say my first website 
my first website so from here now i can just save and then i will go now to my website and then i refresh here and then can you see that the title is already here so it means now we are now doing now the we are now actually um, doing things onto our website so we can also add the next one uh, let's add two headings i just want you to see the difference between the first heading and the second heading so this one now uh, it will be ht because the first one is h1 so the next heading will be h2 so h2 yeah okay this is small case so h2 and then the closing tag we say you start with a backslash and then h2 like that and then you put the text inside so okay i'll say i am using html html i am using html and then okay let me just correct this okay if i save then we go to our browser to see if everything's going well so can you see now my first heading is my first website and then the second heading would be i am using html so can you see the difference now that the size themselves are different this is the first heading so the font will be a little bit bigger and then for the second heading it will be a little bit smaller okay so now we are done with the headings now we go to the body or the description now maybe you want to add some a paragraph or just add the paragraph so like i said before everything that you do or everything that you enter you'll be putting in you'll be putting in um you'll be putting in uh, inside the text so the text the paragraph now is p so i'll put my opening and closing text so paragraphs is p let me put caps lock off so this is p and then the closing tag will be backslash p like that okay and then obviously i can't type everything so i think i put a wait document here i'll just copy everything here for my paragraph i'll just copy and paste onto my text editor okay so if i paste em so and then if i say save i just want to see now if everything is fine on the website okay so let's refresh so there you are so i put my first uh, heading here my second heading and then this is my paragraph or my description of my website and then from there now let's add a picture to just make things beautiful so with picture now the command is a little bit different so now oh, the first thing that you do now is you have to put the picture in that folder okay so this is our folder so i will choose this picture i'll just click to put it in that folder that our uh, first html file is and then let me just rename this to say um pick pic one okay. so it's pic one dot png okay now we go back now to so what you have to do is you have to remember this name or what i can do is i can just come and say rename and then i select everything and then i copy like that it will be much easier than to cream okay now i go to my text editor so i open my text and then in the in, in, inside there it's a i m g and then space s c r so it's s c r so this is image and then the source and then you put an equal sign and then in quotes you put now the name of that image so here i'll just paste that's a name that I I, 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 I I copied okay so with the app here i come here i save and i go now to my website and i refresh okay what's wrong here what's wrong here what is my image not showing okay i think i didn't save it i save let's see Okay, I think the image that I used, okay, let me just use another image quickly. Okay, if I'm to take this image, let me use this one. Um, okay, let me try this one. Okay, so this one now, if I copy the name, 
copy and then I go now to my image and then uh, I remove this and then I paste it should not give me problems okay and then I save and then I go now to my website Okay, so I made a mistake here. I said SCR. It's supposed to be SRC. It's SRC. SRC. So this is what you call the bug. If you say after you are done, if, after you are putting in your commands now, if something doesn't work, you have to go back now to your commands and see where you would have made, made a mistake. Okay, so now if I go back now to uh, my, and then I load like this. So can you see that the picture is here? Because now the command is okay. So this is our first website. So this is the first heading the second heading the paragraph and the picture so this is a simple website so just subscribe so that you will see more of these videos so that you can actually improve your skill now i'll be making another video for for you to to actually see how you can position this picture how you can format the whole page put in the background color and do all the plus the classes or the makeup to the website so just click on subscribe and notifications so that you want to miss any of the future videos okay bye for now